Hey, welcome back out there in the internet world. How y'all doing? We are playing more Super Mario 64. I have a headache. And by we, I mean Jamie. What? I have a headache. Oh. My head hurts. What's the star? Uh, Your head hurts because, well. I got off of work and my head started hurting. And that's that's the end of my story. Probably need to drink some water or take some ibuprofen. Ibuprofen sounds like a new catchphrase. Or you could. I no, mean, I mean, I, just I be proofing be proof out here in the streets. I don't know what that means. I almost had a brain aneurysm because I was so stupid. <laughs> Play the game. <laughs> Express elevator, hurry up. Oh, that's the one that I was... That you were trying to do, correct. Okay. Okay, I got it. I think I understand what I need to do. Do you understand what you need to do? I, I think I do. All right, guys. He says he thinks he knows what he's going to do. Will I be able to execute it? I don't know. <laughs> You the one that wanted this. Anyway, what was I gonna say? I had things lined up that I was gonna talk about, but can I talk about something that really fucking grinds my gears? What grinds your gears, Jamie? I was at fucking Wendy's. Okay, right? yeah, you were supposed to tell me like two episodes <laughs> ago. What the hell happened? Then thing comes in and he's just like, he, I had the worst experience at the Wendy's, and I'm like, <laughs> so how was I like? <laughs> <laughs> no <laughs> shit, it worked. Yeah, dude, that was awesome. Oh my god. So I was like, well, tell me what happened. Goddamn. And he was all like, ah, I'll tell you when we start recording the show. And he didn't do it. Well, now I'm doing it. Oh my God. He just kind of like slow turned. <laughs> <laughs> I was scared for you for a second. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So what happened at Wendy's? Tell the good people what happened at the Wendy's establishment. So Fresh, I never frozen beef. Oh, it wasn't the food. It was the way it was presented to me. Let me just say that. Because oh. I love Wendy's. That's fine. Explain what I'm, happened. I'm about to. I'm about to focus on getting to this bitch Jesus first. Jesus fucking Christ. Hold on. 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 Ooh, ooh. Ah, fuck. What? Perfect. Thanks. Appreciate it. I like the enthusiasm. <laughs> <laughs> So why are you doing this slow ass climb back to the top? What happened? So I was at Wendy's and yeah. I was getting food for fuck. I was getting food for the um God. I was getting food for before we were recording. And uh, I don't think that worked. Anyway. And so I get the food, it's great. I'm like, cool, let me go drive down the road. And uh, I'm about to lose my shit right now. Because if I don't land perfectly on this one, I'm just gonna play for Okay. Well, you're gonna be dead. Well, oh no 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 That's all you need. No, you only recovered one section. Hold on, I'm about to get some more. Leave me alone. What? Shut up, you out there. Our roommate is just like evil laughing this whole damn time because he hears Jamie's cries from a freaking defeat. I'm not defeated yet. I got the power of God in hand. <laughs> 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 Are you laughing at what I said? I'm like? laughing at both what you said and what just said outside. <laughs> oh, you not mean to me. I'm not mean to you. So what happened? You were driving down the street and you stepped in a pile of who shit? These nuts. Jump, boy! Ha! Ha! I did it! Ha 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 ha! I didn't do it. I did it. Um, did I'm, I I'm seventy percent sure you didn't think that was gonna work. Ah, nigga! What? Stay. I'm still here. Stay. I'm still here. Stay. Who the fuck designs an elevator like this? Fucking Peach. Nintendo. Bitch. What the fuck is going on in your castle, bitch? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> the fuck. Trials of the Mushroom Kingdom. <laughs> So, <laughs> you got down the road and so, what happened? And so this bitch doesn't put the fucking lid on my drink properly. Fucking 64 ounces of pure liquid fucking deliciousness gets all up under, like, under where I'm sitting in my seat because I lift my legs up. I'm like, oh shit, my legs gonna get wet. And then it gets all over the floor. I'm not wearing socks with my flats. 
And then, so, my fucking butt is still wet. And so, I'm just like, bitch. So, I go back into the Wendy's. And, by the way, she didn't give me enough ketchup either. Oh, I no. I was pissed. You didn't get enough ketchup. Hey, 70 ketchup. stars. I love ketchup. You know this. Thanks to you, Bowser, to you upset. Now, final <laughs> bout. We're not doing that, by the way. Yeah, yeah we're getting more stars. Bars and stars. I shouldn't say that. Um. Is <laughs> <laughs> went to that meeting with the kid just sitting there with the cup looking like? <laughs> no, <laughs> no. My experience was the freaking kid just sitting there with his crying, just like. Just you know what's crying. ironic about what you just said? What the same thing happened to me like three months ago. Oh my god! The same thing. They didn't put my lid all the way, and I hit that turn coming to back to my house mm -hmm. right there in front of uh, Fairchild, and I was like. Hit this turn! Yay! Cup! Almost went turn to the planet. <laughs> right. I was... And I was like... And it was... I had a freaking ice cold lemonade with no ice. That bitch was about to be so right. Dude, I don't know where the fucking... And that bitch fell. Press start. Which one is it? It's the Red Coins one. Oh, yeah. Okay, so this is what you gotta do for this. You see that thing over there? You see that cage? Yeah. Loop cage. That... That takes you down to um, the town area. So oh, you need to... fuck. I remember this now. So you need to drop down. What are you doing? Uh, I need drop to the water level. I, I do. Right. Actually, no. Raise the water level. Pump, pump, pump. Unless you, many unless you want to canning yourself over there. There's too many jump button references. <laughs> our friend... <laughs> and you, and I'll, I'll just leave it at that. I'm not going to say... Our friend Fluffy... Oh, I'm not no. going to give any names. <laughs> She's probably gonna watch this episode. Probably not because she hates me, and I've called First, her out on it. I'm, I'm about to call her out on because she has never watched any of our episodes. But anyway, what? I don't think she has. This bitch. Right. <laughs> <laughs> so we were coming back because we were we we went to the movies on Friday, and so things happened, and we had to help them help her out because we're friends. Oh, is and she, I is she okay? I wasn't there. Uh, she's fine. I did good. Um. <clears throat> So, I had to take her and her boyfriend home. And we're in the car, and she makes a reference to that video that I posted of freaking Joe Button going in on, oh, no. on uh, Little Easy Bird's uh, freaking uh, album when he just straight up called it trash. Oh, no. <laughs> and we got to talking about hip-hop. Oh, no. And... <laughs> <laughs> That's her first mistake. <laughs> and I was like... <laughs> Cause she asked, she was like, "What is a mumbo rap?" And I was like, oh, "Okay, no. let me explain to you what mumbo rap is." Oh. So I explained it to her. So, fuck, that's not what you want. But the, where you need to go, you said a little slant right there. You need to go. I know. I fucked it up. Okay. <laughs> At least you know where to go. So yeah. she's like, "What's mumbo rap?" So I explained it to her, and I'm like, "Okay, so it's like Migos." And she just gives me that blank stare, and I'm like, <laughs> "Um, little Yachty," another blank stare. Oh <laughs> <I'm like, laughs> no. Oh, no. Well, little Uzi, little Uzi Bird, you watched the video, right? And she's like, no, I just know his name because of the video because the guy was so mad and I was trying to figure out why he was so mad. And it was just kind of funny because he was really upset. And I was like... <laughs> That's how she's... <laughs> it's perfect. <laughs> perfect. <laughs> so, so I was like... Oh. But that, I was like... We got into a discussion about hip hop, but she did ask me an interesting question, and she was like, "So why why doesn't Joe Budden like uh, make the music anymore? Well, no, why does scroll. why does he not like? <laughs> <laughs> why does he not? I, I explained it to her. I was like, Joe Budden had, it was a one hit wonder. Like his underground stuff was good, but like in terms of being a hit maker, yeah, he God. only had one hit. Do can I get up this way? Yes. Yeah. Okay. God. <laughs> so, um. <laughs> So we're talking, and she asked me a good question. She's like, "Well, what about the, what 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 exactly about the album does Joe Budden think that is trash?" And I'm like, "Well, you know, at first he's a mumble he's a mumble rapper. He doesn't really like that." And and I was like, "Another reason is he says um, in the video how he listened to the album, and um, he doesn't feel that there was any connection, you know, in the album. He's like, he listened to the album." He, of course, listened to the lyrics and, you know, listen to your bars and see how your bars are. He's like, there was nothing relatable. There was nothing in there. And she's like, what do you mean? And I was like, well, for starters, yeah, hit that switch right there. <clears throat> I was like, for starters, um, 
he um he just talks about party music and he doesn't really talk anything talk anything about you know going through the struggle you know. But hold on, what was Pump It Up though? <laughs> Never mind, go ahead. That, no, that, no, that's what I kind of said. I was like, well, and I was like, Joe Budden is also kind of kind of hypocritic because like his out his song Pump It Up, even though it it was it was like a two thousand and four version of a hit, a mumble rap hit. Because that's all it was. He was just pump, 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 pump. Where are you going? Fuck my life. I don't know. <laughs> you can refill your health this way. This is nice. This is good. Put your head out. Put your head out. Oh. Now just go over there. Oh yeah, you're right. Um, and I'm and I'm trying to explain this to her, and she's like, "Well, do you think every single song needs to be about the struggle?" And I straight up look her in her eyes. I said, "Well, kinda, yeah." <laughs> Man. It's- yeah, especially now. Like, yeah, it's like relevant. <laughs> Hip hop has always been about what's relevant. Like, generally speaking, in my opinion, pretty much. Yeah. So I mean, you need to fire yourself. I want to fire to that. Oh, 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 oh. got it. Oh, oh, okay. Fire's got like a little bit of weirdness going on. Okay. But it's got a star. Good. I, I don't know. It's one of those things. I quickly said yes, but the more I think about it, I'm like, what well, does every song need oh. to be about? The struggle, because that's basically what Joe Budden was alluding to. He he didn't feel anything that was like talking about the struggle of a black man. Basically, that's basically what Joe Budden was getting at. But that's not. I mean, it doesn't have to be. No. Oh Jesus, that's you fired too high. Yeah. True. Back. Um. No, every song doesn't have to be. I mean, just like. I mean, just like in times of trouble, you always need some type of entertainment. And that's what it is about. It's about, I mean, I feel like it's a balance. Like, offering awareness and also, I mean, you gotta look at, I don't know. The first, it's probably a bad reference because it's Macklemore because, you know, he's a white rapper, blah, 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 a lot of criticism. But, I mean, like, look on his most, uh, not his most recent album because he just had another album come out. Oh, fuck. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, my God. <laughs> yeah, boy. <laughs> Talking about Flavor Flav. God. All right, so you got to get there, and you got to... Oh, my God. This is going to be the worst. Sorry if you can hear my clicking in the mic. I'm just trying to get there super fast. I wonder how many people got tripped up over this part. Did you remember when the Game Girls played this part? I mean, vaguely. Aaron is one of them. Oh, over the greats? He got fucked up over the greats? Well, no, I'm talking about in uh, terms of the, uh... What do you mean? What part are you talking about? Oh, you're talking about just the, the great area. The greats, I'm yeah. talking about just getting to here. Oh, God. <laughs> um, okay. So, what do I need to do? Uh, figure it out. Oh, God. Um. Okay, so I'm gonna jump that high. I feel like something is somewhere. Well, it's not very descriptive. Is that not a? Can I tell you something about this town? What about it? Ain't shit in here. So there's a switch. You're right. There's a switch down here. We gotta hit. I just don't know where the fuck it is. Turn to the right. Turn to the right. Turn to. So right there? No. There's a switch down there on the lower part. But no, that's one of the um you need to go up for air. You need to go up for air. Yeah. Yeah, I feel like, I mean, if you look at that Macklemore CD I was just talking about where it has um the white privilege song on it, he has plenty of good hits on there. They're just pretty fun, blah blah blah. But I mean, he has that song on there that gets like real serious. I mean, I feel like there's a balance. There's a switch kid. Um oh, there it is. I feel like there's a balance in everything though. That's True. just my opinion. But you know, like, well, I mean, that's the thing. That's a, that's the, the the joke about Joe Budden. Like, he's so serious, but like, that's one of the things. Like, Lil Yachty during that interview, Lil Yachty was like, "Yo, chill." Like, <laughs> right? I mean, who are you to be telling somebody else how to do their fucking craft? Like, I don't know. That's, that's how a, that, like, that's yeah. how them old heads are, man. They, oh man, they really, really. Really hate newer music, and I can understand it because there's a lot of newer songs that's trash. Like, I'm sorry, but there are some songs that are just, just bad, just 
bad. But there's also some new songs that are like freaking awesome that and I think they don't even get that much like credit. Like a lot of songs from freaking um the fuck? That's what a switch. You hit a switch. Go look around, see what the hell you switched. I don't know what I just did. Okay. Well you gotta get the, this is red coins, so you gotta get red coins. Common question of the day, guys. Um, if you've seen that video with Joe Button, do you agree or disagree? Do you think Little Uzi Vert's album is trash? Let me know in the comment section below. What do you think? I haven't listened to the whole album, but I love Exo Turtle Life. I like that song. But, you know, I always listen to songs that are from a producer standpoint, so. Yeah, I'm yeah. sure. Yeah. I know how that goes. Um. Trying to figure out where to go. What do you mean? You gotta get red coins. Th thank you. But I'm trying to figure out where. Oh, 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 oh. Okay. Well, we'll see if Jamie can figure out this mystery. <laughs> and see if Jamie can figure out this mystery <laughs> on the next episode. But y'all, in, in the meantime, y'all stay sexy. Sweet dreams. Hit it! Hit this one.